Brentech, yeah, where tech is made simple. So we have another week and another Dev Channel build. So this week we get build 25284, which is the latest Windows 11 Insider Preview build, which was made available on the 25th of January, which was once again late yesterday in my region. Now this week in the Dev Channel, um, not too much really exciting happening. Um, we have a new widget and then bug fixes and then obviously some known issues because it is the Dev Channel. And it is still early days, so there are a couple of bugs. Now, just head into the release notes for build 25284 and heading down to the one and only new official feature for this week. And that's a new widget, which is a new um, a messenger widget, third party widget for the widgets board in build uh, 25284. Now, um, as many of you may know, um, developers are now able to create widgets for their apps. Uh, that's third-party developers. And um, the Messenger app now, according to Microsoft, has a preview version of its widget available, as we can see from the screenshot provided. And um, to get this um, in the latest Dev Channel build, you need to go to the Microsoft Store and update the latest version of Messenger. And then you need to come to Widgets, open the Widgets board and navigate to the widgets picker by clicking on the the add or the plus sign at the top right of the board to pin your widget as you can see once again from the screenshot and that's just a quick overview of the new messenger uh, widget now available in the latest dev channel build and microsoft does say with this um, recent change that you should expect to see additional new widgets as more developers create and release widgets for their apps so that's really the only um, new feature really worth mentioning uh, for this week. But over and above that, um, there is one relevant fix here. They fixed an issue where right-clicking on certain icons in the hidden icons flyout would make the flyout dismiss rather than bringing up the context menu for that icon. So that's quite a significant fix. And then there is a fix for search on the taskbar, an input fix, windowing, other, one or two other fixes. And then we get the known issues as mentioned because this is the... Um, the dev channel that we are dealing with so it is still early days so there are a lot of bugs in the dev channel and um, over and above that not really too much else to let you know about but microsoft does make mention of one interesting um kind of change here for this week um they say this build will not be available for arm 64 devices due to a known issue so just take note of that if you are in the dev channel and i'll leave a link uh, to these release notes in the description if that would be of interest. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.